Well, good evening wherever you are on this most pleasant evening. As you can Hello see, there's everybody. been a, a terrific atmosphere here. Match. There is great expectation, excitement, and it has built nicely in these idyllic conditions. Conditions which are certainly playing their part in creating a glorious ambience. It's quite a struggle to get in here. Points of access, hard to come by, and an awful lot of people gathering to get through the gates. But regardless of that, there's a great feel here and much excitement for the game ahead. And the mood is boisterous. It is a perfect ambience for the central characters who are ready now to perform. If you're just joining us, we are already on the way. Gets his pass away. And now a sudden chance to counter. Good work on the right flank here. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. Lima. Savitsa. Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Well, that's confidence for you. Distance doesn't even bother him. Oh, that's a key interception. It's a really well-measured ball. He's got away. Savica. And the defence can get it clear. Well, he got rid because he was under pressure. And they're quick to get it back. Indonesia so far providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. Forwards and with intent. Danso. Baumgartner. Such good technique. Real chance! Well, we've seen the hunger to win it back and the focus to make it count. A very tasty combination. The goal scorer for Austria after 29 minutes is number 11, Gregorich. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and just as the manager's been reminding his players, this is the time where they can't afford to let their focus slip. Done so. Oh, it's a promising build-up, this. Plenty of really nice passing. Well, that is one way to stop him. The ball has bounced loose now. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Indonesia truly have no need to panic. They can reassess at half-time. And he cuts out the supply. That's going to go a long way. Baumgartner. There will be a throw-in. Out again for a throw-in. Now it's Lima. It's run loose here. Cleared away. Now he's off and running. There will be one. He's intervened well time. there. Brilich. And there is the half-time whistle. Oh, it's a half which has uh, simmered along nicely. Warming up to what may be a more open second half to follow.
Well, it hasn't exactly gone to plan so far, but there's no need to panic. There's still plenty of time to get back into this. As always, an early goal would help swing things back in their favour. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Indonesia don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal. Bongarda! They want to be quick to recover this. That's Grinich. Lima. That's just playing it safe and simple. Done so. That's a good intervention. That was what he had to make in the face of danger that was growing. That's a good run down the left. No, that's been intercepted. Oh, that's really good play on the right. He's driving forward. Indonesia, still this single goal behind. It's the sort of situation that they'll want to the capitalise on now. Forward it goes. Driving forward. There's a sharp little ball here. It's... Oh, that's a foul in a dangerous area. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Players have gathered round and they are clearly concerned. Well, you can blame some suspect defensive positioning for that set of circumstances and they were just left with little choice. Substitutions taking place. Sabitzer! And that's caused a worry or two. Well, he's furious with himself, but at least the boss is applauding his effort then. Well, that had the makings of something quite promising, but it's fizzled out into nothing. Could have been dangerous, but it came to nothing. Cleared without complication. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Indonesia are not doing enough to get themselves back in the game. They're not as threatening as their opposition. It's got to change. Sabitzer. He's gone forward. Arnautovic really needed to concentrate on protecting the ball. Then again, he was being very closely marshalled. This is the time you need that pace. Well, yet another interception and uh, a show of anticipation to be commended. Indonesia really might just end up kicking themselves after that. That could well have been it. Time and again, they are repelled. Indonesia must do something here and very quickly. All they need is one big chance and it may do the trick. They'll want to make the most of this turnover. Now it's bound Gartner. That's positional gold. He utilised... He gets big! He will be livid with himself. Substitution. Austria have turned to their bench and we're going to have a substitution. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not Two quite able. Has been indicated. Threads one in. Uh, he's had it taken off him. Oh, what a mistake! Oh, that is a nice touch. He straight hits! And that may well be that. That is that. Well, that was tense. The two parties separated by the game's only really meaningful moment. Intriguing for the neutrals, unbearable, sometimes unwatchable 
for those with a vested interest. Your final thoughts, Jim? Well, the way the manager has stormed down the tunnel lends itself to an almighty telling off for such a, a timid, docile display. Well, that's it for tonight's match. So it just remains for me to thank Jim Beglin alongside me and to wish you all a very good evening.